Yeah, remember Buddy Walters? He sing the blues, babe. <laughs> Hello, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Pokemon Clover. I finally found a fucking Pokemon that knows Flash. It's Snowball! So hopefully uh, we can make it through just fine without Gremlin. I think I dropped Gremlin off. Yeah. She's the one. So we'll head back into the rock tunnel. God damn it. Son of a... Bastard! Alright. Here we go. Flash it up. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that so much better? I don't know why I fucking insisted on not doing this last episode, but that was how it went, and it was uh, quite disappointing, so hopefully we can do a little better this time around. There's Mr. Phoenix, right? It's just, it's just so much better. It's just so much better when you can see where you're going. Uh, so there's a Charagon. Probably any of these fire types or electric types can learn Flash. I don't know why Snow Yeti can learn it. Maybe it's a fairy type, something like that. I don't really know. Not for sure. Anyways, uh, there's these two ladders, so I know one basically just leads to the top of that rock or whatever that we found the leaf stone on. I don't know if I could use the leaf stone on anybody either. This other one, let's see what it do. Baby Boo! And yeah, there's the rock to the right there that we were walking around on top of. I don't know if that has another ladder on top of it that maybe I didn't see when it was all dark and shit like that. But, we'll see. We shall see! It doesn't look like it. Which is fortunate. I don't want to go back. I've been working so hard to get through this fucking rock tunnel. Damn it, piss balls! Um, there's an up ladder. I think that's the one we, we came in on. Isn't it? Isn't it? Perhaps. Once again, not really sure. Although this this doesn't loop back around, does it? So maybe it is. We're supposed to go that way. I don't I don't really know. I guess we're just gonna push through and, and see how it go. See how it go. That trip back from uh, Gaddick City was quite a bitch. I had to go through Mount Mood again, which thankfully I did sort of remember the way a little bit. It didn't take too horribly long at least. So, hey! Hey, buddy! You're a new trainer! Hey, we found our way! Kinda. I think I saw that ladder last time and talked myself out of taking it. Or did I? I don't know. Pokemon Fest is the best way to relax after a hike! Well, it looks like you're still in the middle of your hike, bro. I'd hate to interrupt! Uh, I'll leave. Hiker will. They should have, like, a backpacker, you know? Backpack rappers. And he's, like, got a backwards hat and shit. He's like, hey! Hey, I'm pretty cool! And I'm like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. I think this thing's dark and ground, so faint attack might uh, not do great damage against it. Or I could be completely wrong. Maybe it's ghost and ground. I, I don't really know. I honestly don't know. We'll just uh, keep faint attacking since it seems to work. There you go. Get out of here. Go on. Get. And we just got one more. So what did that? Haramite. Oh, this is the just like that conchilla thing. Conchilla! I thought about catching it because it was really adorable. Oh, but it's rocky. It knows rock type moves. That's not, that's not, that's not something I really want to deal with. So let's go into, we'll go into Douglas. He's a bulky boy. He can handle that shit no problem. I just don't want to uh, screw my, my bug type up too bad. That's the guy with the cleanse tag. We got to keep him nice and healthy. So he, Fucking use his curse a little bit, that's fine. I'm gonna try a bullet seed. BULLET SEED! It doesn't seem to be super effective or anything, but maybe I can get like five hits. And that would be just delicious. Simply delicious! It is super effective. So this thing is just bulky as shit. And it knows bubble beam? What? What what are you? I should have caught one just so I'd know what what type it actually is. Whatever, I guess. Just keep bullet seeding. Bullet seeds all day, kid! Got it for you right here, son! And there we go. Knock it out the box. Alright. Not bad. That thing is really adorable, even the evolved form. Which, uh... If you've been watching our Pokemon Uranium streams, you might know is not always the case. 
So is the smell of my own sweat. Gross. And attacked Manimar. Gross. My Pokemon love the taste of my fresh ass sweat. <laughs> That's why he died so quickly. He didn't have any nutrition. No nutritions. Let's see. We got some fresh waters. We got some potions. I'll use fresh water. There you go, Kek. So you can be healthy and keep things wrecked. Wrecked Roach. Yeah, bitch. Alright. So we'll continue on. It doesn't look like there's anything else of interest on this level. So uh, we'll head down the ladder. Head down the ladder, hopefully make it through the rock tunnel. I don't know why I wouldn't talk to that uh, old man that was hiding the Flash HM. Probably because he wanted to show me his Venice. <laughs> or something like that. And there's that steel type. I really like it. I really kind of like it. And I want to catch it just a little bit. But um, also, meh. Whatever. Hey, lady. What you doing? Like my tits, kid? Uh, I'm just a kid. I'm just a kid and I know that it's not fair. Tranny J sends out lastly. Lastly and firstly. All right, whatever. Faint attack, it looks like a ghost. Maybe a dark type. Oh yeah, it's a ghost for sure. Super effective damage. And it uses barrier, which is gonna boost that defense. But it's too late. Kek is already on the offensive. Knocking this shit away. Blam. Go on, get out. That's like really humanish Pokemon. I mean, there's lots of humanish Pokemon, but it's, it's always surprising to me to see one. Especially when it looks more human than not. Like, maybe you could say Jinx or Alakazam or some shit is human-like. It does. It is in the human shape egg group, but yeah, it's not really as human-like as that Pokemon was. You think Mr. Mime is human-like? Hell no. Hell no, he ain't. He gross. So that thing uses takedown. That's not gonna do much, but I need to switch up uh, faint attack because this thing obviously has a dark typing. Dark and maybe something else. But, uh, Bug Bite. Bug Bite's where it's at, that's right. Let's get it in! Let's get ready to rumble. He uses Rest, which is only gonna save him for a couple of turns. It's not gonna help. I bet you don't even have Sleep Talk, do you? Fucking noob. Noob, bruh! Such a noob! And now you dead. Now you dead, get on out! Get on out! Get on up! What do you mean they're not real? Um, I mean, they're real silicone. <laughs> I think they look real. Yeah, you're, you're kind of not the the best one to ask. You can't be like, these tits totally look real, because, yeah, they're your tits. Of course you think they look real, or else you'd have them taken off. You done screw them. So we got a Soothe Bell. I'll give Douglas that Soothe Bell. And, uh, or no, Douglas gets the Cleanse Tag. I'll give Keck the Soothe Bell. I don't really know what uh, raising the friendship is going to do. It's fine. Whatever. It be what it be. We're just trying to avoid some fights. What the fuck did you say about my memes? I said they're weak, bro. You got some weak shit going on over here. Pokemon Ranger Jojo sent out Makmona. That is the ghost and fighting type. So, I really wish I had uh, Kek out here still, but that's fine. Douglas knows Bite too. Oh, that's not going to do shit because he's ghost and fighting type. So the ghost is weak to dark, but the fighting resists dark, so it's just a neutral hit. So if we're going to do neutral hits, we might as well get the same type of attack bonus. Hit it with some bullet seeds. Blah, blah. Look at that. That does a pretty good amount of damage. This thing's defenses are weak. Maybe I'm glad I didn't put it on my team. Especially because I, I don't know what it's referencing. So... That's another major reason that I gave it a pass. I'm like, eh, I don't really like it. That fucking Dubs Pokemon, I do want to catch it. Because everybody knows what Dubs are. But like, look at this, bruh. Check out my Dubs. I got trips. That's how you know I'm telling the truth. <laughs> Muscle dude. Muscle dude. All right, let's bulk up. He's using Foresight. That's fine. Go ahead. Identify me. As long as he doesn't have Dynamic Punch or some crazy move like that, we should be fine. I'm gonna get this level right here! So we're bulked up. Hit him with some bullet seeds. Oh, bulk up does nothing against Seismic Toss. Seismic Toss just hits based on level, which is, um, 
kind of shit. A little bit shit. But look at that. Bullet Seed is just going to wreck his day. Wow. That is impressive. Is it super effective? Not even super effective. Just just one bulk up. And that's what it do. That's what it do, baby boo. Sweet. You're gone. You done. Yara yara days. Uh, okay. Bye. The next thing you're going to say is nothing. Whoa, dude. You seem kind of psychic or something? That's crazy! Decker had a Quick Claw. I guess I can give the Quick Claw to Douglas for now. We're just doing a bunch of switching. I wasn't so obsessed with switching around items until I switched around that Lucky Egg and it made the training go so much faster and now I'm like, oh yeah, I can just switch items as needed. That's wonderful. WONDERFUL! Alright, so now we're up on top of another rock. Was this where the Karate Man was? Yeah. I see him over there. It's all coming together, isn't it? Amazing! I don't know if I want to send out Decker against the Karate Man, but we've got, um, Pecker in the back. He's in the back seat. He's waiting. Come on, bitch. Let's do this. Hey there, everybody. This is Ryu from the streets. Whoa. wonder if we're going to find Ken in here somewhere. That'd be cool. Black Belt. Ryu! Ryu! Charon. Water and fighting? I guess that's really a bad matchup for uh, for Decker. So let's get him out of there. I don't want none of that. Although uh, Pecker's not gonna resist any fighting type moves. Oh shit! It's Ice Punch. That's bad. Well, I should be able to live a couple of them. And that thing got hurt by rough skin, so that's sweet. Let's get this wing attack going. Yeah. Not gonna just switch around. Hope for a better fucking tight matchup or something. We'll just do what we do. Push on through. That's right. So that thing goes down hard. He's got another one though. That's alright. You know what I do now? Same thing I do every night. Wing attack! He had that mock punch though. Hopefully he doesn't use it again. Oh, never mind. He didn't live. He didn't even live. These fucking wing attacks too strong. My wing attack too strong! Chaz Sumo. Chad plus Sumo. He's got fuck you on his belt. Yeah, you fuck my mother! Eat my shit! <laughs> What's he gonna do? Oh, bulk up. That's alright. It ain't gonna save ya. It's too late. You're going to hell. Little boy, go to hell! Little boy, it's time for you to pay! Down he goes. Easy. Easy squeezy! And we grew. We grew some more. And I like those triple digit HPs. Hell yeah! See you in Street Fighter V, everybody! Yep, yep, that's out if anybody uh, wants to buy it. My favorite things are jumping into light, fierce, stale bread without any ice. The newest seasons of The Simpsons and dirt. Eat dirt, bitch! Good thing you like dirt, because I made you eat dirt, bitch! Hey, lady. When he asked me if I wanted to play Cave Explorer with him, this isn't what I had in mind. I get it. He wanted to see Vagina and Bobs. And we got a full heal. Pretty sweet. What a savings. We don't have to buy that for like 400 Poke or some shit like that. They're pretty expensive. <clears throat> I don't like spending money on uh, full heals. I'll buy a full restore any day of the week. But even full restore can't bring Pokemans back from the dead. And max revives are super rare, so that's why I haven't just used the one that I found. I'm super grateful for it. I like it a lot. I should make it a Nuzlocke and then just be like, oh yeah, you can use revives if you find them. <clears throat> if you find them. My voice is going. I think it's some screeching earlier. Plebbles! Oh, look at it, so cute! We've already got a rock type though. That's fine. Get out of here. Oh, is this an artist? Nice beret, kid. Oh, it's a gnome! Midget Sneezy sent out Silvi Silvuin. Silvuin? I don't know how to say that. I don't really know how to say that! I think this is a rock type. Rock Ghost? Is that right? Am I remembering correctly? How's Magnitude do? Magnitude 7! Super effective! Yeah, bitch! Cosmic power. I 
think that raises his defenses. Yeah. That's not gonna be good. Can't let him continue this shit for too long. Magnitude 10! Come on! Oh, magnitude 6. That's not good. Maybe one more magnitude if we get really, really lucky. Nope, he starts recovering. God damn it. How? How could this be? Well, if I if I hit a magnitude 10, we'll, we'll be good to go. But I, I just can't seem to do it. Can't seem to do it. I don't know what's happening. Rock Tomb, that's not going to do shit, bro. It does drop my speed, but yeah. Not very effective, I think. Oh, rock against rock is just fine, apparently. I did not realize. Whatever. Just keep using magnitudes. It seems to be con consistent magnitude 7, which is enough to destroy a town. A shittily built town. <laughs> oh, self destruct. There he goes. Does nothing. Ha ha ha. Wonderful. That fucking fight was never gonna end if he didn't self destruct. Glass. Glass shot? Hmm. What is this? Let's try rock throw. It might be steel type, or it might be ice type. I mean, yeah, glass cannon makes me think steel type. Well, rock throw uh, is inconclusive, so I'm not sure. Use rock blast but missed, which is great. There's the magnitude 8, also great, and that should KO. And it is super effective, so I'm not sure. It's not steel type, because rock throw is also uh, hit normally. Hitting normally. I'm quite unsure. Decker's trying to learn Rock Blast. Ooh. Rock Throw, 50. Rock Blast, 25. So, yeah. Rock Blast is better than Rock Throw. Das for sure, Lee! Because you can hit multiple times. 25, 25, 25. 25 times 5? It's 125. That's fucking crazy. That's better than Earthquake, son. If you manage to hit all of your, uh all of your rock blasts, which doesn't usually happen. This thing's using rapid spin, uh, okay. All right, that, that's fine if you want to do that. I mean, I'm not gonna say you shouldn't, or that it's a terrible move, because then you would use something else and beat me, maybe. Probably not, though. My poke's too strong, my poke's too strong! I do have to grind him up again, but we'll save that for a later date. When I decide to take a little break, I'll be like, all right, it's time. Now it's time. There we go. Swept this shit under the rug. He didn't even have a ground move. That's so sad. Why wouldn't you keep a ground move on him? Terrible. Terrible. Achoo! Aw, oh, I'm sorry, Midget Sneezy. Nice beard, though. Achoo! I should tell you that there are only seven midgets in all of fortune. I'm one of them. Achoo! Achoo! <laughs> yes. Yes, you are. Alright, so everybody's level 31 now, including Gremlin, who's in the PC. So that's quite nice. I should, uh, keep the cleanse tag in the front, lest I be confronted by even more of these wild pokes. So, wow! Fucking wow, kid! Wow and out! Alright, that's enough. Um, maybe up here somewhere? There's a youngster. Should I fight the youngster? Yeah, that's, that's easy. I could beat up like 40 toddlers at the same time, even if they have backwards hat and think they're cool. Did anybody ever really think backwards hats were cool in the 90s, I guess? I thought my Semrus was fully evolved, but then I accidentally gave it a stone and it evolved again! It's not even next to Semrus in the decks! Who numbered it? That fucking guy. That fucking guy. You remember that guy? We met him. We met him! He's a pretty cool guy. Oh, there's the exit. Hell yeah. But I also want to see what's down that last uh, branch of the cave. Yes, indeed! My curiosity cannot be content and and and. Why? Because there might be something cool. Oh god, it's another ladder. Oh, with a gift. Water stone! I wonder if there's also a fire stone somewhere in here. But whatever. I can't really even... I can't really even. I don't know what Pokemon use these stones in this version, so I guess we'll just hang on to it for now. If I feel like somebody should evolve, then I'll be like, hey, maybe try this. Just pull it out and wave it at some of my Pokemon, and if they start responding to it, then I'll be like, all right, put this in your mouth. Is that how stones work? I don't know. I don't really know. Ah, Route 8. We made it. 
It's a berry tree holding colubber berry. So many fucking different berries. I don't understand. Rock tunnel. Yep. Done. Oh, hey. Core rooster? Yeah, I got one. Hey, Preku. Hey, Preku. You got one too? Show it to me. And then, uh, my fucking. Yeah. Decker can just rock. Rock blast the shit out of all your Pokemans. Rock blast. Bleh. Oh, God. That's so good. And a crit. What? All day. All day. All day long. Super sweet. All right, cool. Next. Rotator. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess. I think it's a gra grass type or something. It uses amnesia. Raises special defense. She's not gonna do shit because rock blast is physical. So I don't know what you're what you're after. What's going on here? What's going on here? Oh, rock blast does fucking like nothing. Is that a fighting type? Is he just breaking my rocks as I shoot them at him? Hit five times and did jack shit. Not very effective. That's a shame. And magnitude nine. Oh god! I'm sorry, Decker! I'm sorry! I didn't know! And it's a crit. Holy shit. That is scary! Damn, Retainer! You scary! Alright, let's send Phil out here. He got some of that ice punch. Ice punching action! Cha 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 cha! That should work just fine. I guarantee it's plant and fighting. Yeah, look at that. Super effective. And I froze him? Oh. Oh. Fate is with me today. I tell you what. Uh, let's try Dizzy Punch. See what that do. Is it gonna KO? Not quite. It defrosted him. Oh. And then he got a magnitude 4. I laugh. I laugh at your magnitude 4. And another Ice Punch, which I should have done last turn, probably. But whatever. Now we threw it. Goo. What a fucking derpy sound he makes. But he gave a lot of EXP. Don't tell mom. Don't tell mom. <laughs> ah, where's your brother? Pickle? Core Rooster? Pickle? Etc. Random non sequitur? Okay, great. Thank you so much for sharing that with me. Let's put Phil in the front. He's my favorite. He really is. Looks badass, is badass. I approximate that you will be defeated! Oh, is that your approximation? Well, let us test your theory, hmm? Let us test this theorem! Hmm, yes! Papacti. Oh, you're gonna get ice punched, son. Cactus can't survive in the ice? Oh, and he used X speed. Dang! These scientists and their uh, experiments. Huh? Huh? Doesn't matter. Critical hit, super effective. Get your shit out of here. Go ahead, waste some more uh, X speeds and whatnot. It's not gonna matter. It's not gonna matter. Feel too strong. You feel that? You feel that? Dragon Claw. Ooh! Oh, it's so good. Dizzy Punch, 70 power. Dragon Claw, 80 power. Easy choice. Easy choice! There you go. Hmm. Wonderful. So yeah, I really like Phil's moveset too. Shit's off the chain! There's nothing that can resist it! Nothing. Nothing! As long as I get to choose my move, I will hit. Possibly super effectively. Look at that. Ooh, that's good damage. Using lock-on. Eh, <laughs> whatever. Whatever, bro. I don't even care. Should use X speed on this thing. At least it survived more than one hit. Bitch! Cool. Done, done. I was wrong! How, how, how shameful of me! Haha. <laughs> C student. Ed! Eddie! Oh. It's... It's Ed. Double D. I know what that's referencing! A show that some people watched. Apparently. I won one of them. There's this... Ghostly tree Pokemon. All my attacks are ineffective against it. Could it be a divine Pokemon? Oh, is it you, Arceus? Hey, where can a guy scam? What do you mean scam? Like, kiss? That's what some people called it back in the 90s. I remember I was at summer camp, and this uh, this chick was like, Hey, want to scam? And we went in the photo booth or whatever, and uh, we were both just terrified to start kissing. 
you know? Like, she wants to, and I want to, but everybody's just kind of like, uh, I don't, I don't really know how to start this. Which, really, it's kind of easy, looking back, but... Whatever, I was a fucking child! I wasn't even double digits! And already these, these girls just coming out of the woodwork. Tell you what. Disgusting! Disgusting! Stay away from me! Don't take my innocence! Oh, I got mock punched. I thought Pecker was gonna get that wing attack and fucking that would be it. But nope! Mock punched hard, bruh! I should probably heal him up. That's, that's my whole problem. Whatever. Mock punch Douglas too. He lives! He lives! Yes! Bullet seed. Eat a bullet seed, bitch! Who would have thought? Eddie. Little Eddie. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Where's Ed? With the 1D. He's the biggest and strongest of them all, if I do remember correctly. Ogre Lord. Holy crap. That thing looks disgusting. It's green, so I don't know if I should be bullet seeding. Bullet seed seems to do okay, though. Yeah, maybe it's a dragon type. Dragon type with some big old arms and shit. Please don't kill me. He's gonna kill me. Muddy water. Yeah, remember Muddy Waters? He sing the blues, babe. <coughs> I can't talk like that anymore. <laughs> Good God. Well, I, beat up's not gonna work. Let's try faint attack. Beat up works better the more Pokemon you have in the party, but most of my Pokemon is fainted. Hmm. I guess this is a dark type. Because he's got crunch, he resisted my faint attack. So guess what? Bug bite. Bug bite in your face. Look at this right here all over the place. That is a really cool looking Pokemon though. I like it a lot. What a cheapskate. Aw, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry this had to happen. Where's Sockhead and Blockhead? Yeah, he's like the littlest one, you know? He thinks he's the smartest one, but really they're all fucking retarded, so... So that's the joke! You're welcome. I explained it. Parax Town! Ooh. It's like Lavender Town, isn't it? Maybe not. Reminds me of, like, Banjo-Kazooie music. Yep, definitely Banjo-Kazooie. Trainer tips! There are hidden items around everywhere. Explore all of those big routes with your item finder, or autistically click A on every tile in the game. <laughs> yeah, let's let's start clicking. Let us stop clicking, friends. My Blavos went to sleep last month, and he didn't wake up yet. I wonder if everything's all right with him. Probably. Do Blavos hibernate? <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, that, that's a mystery to me. All right, here we go. Ding, 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 ding. Welcome back to life, Pokemans! And I should go grab Gremlin out of the PC. I think that would be a, a wise choice. And I'm still debating whether to uh, to swap her out or not, but she'll, she'll stick around for now. That's alright. We already got rid of one of our little friends. You know what? I miss Kim. I miss Kim. Look it. Just just chilling out in the PC like, are you, are you ever coming back for me? Someday! Hi there! I visit Parax Town for a vacation, but never expected to have such annoying music playing, so I hide in where the music can't reach me. Guess that's a fair, fair choice. Tried to catch Pokemon in the Burial Tower, but to, to little success. They were all ghosts. Maybe I need some sort of charm. Oh, scope lens. Whatever. Sylph scope. You want me to commune with ghosts to foresee your future? No. Wise choice. Knowing your future is a terrible burden. I was just scared of disturbing the ghosts. This town's music surely is peculiar. It seemed to have changed every so often, but now the skeleton song's on loop infinitely, it seems. The skeleton song? Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. That's what it is. Alien, go get, go ye, get ye gone. What? I don't understand. Hello, Pokemon. Pleased to be here. Take this, I don't have any idea how it works anyways. Magnet! We don't have any electric type Pokemon though. It increases electric type attacks. Nothing here is in impact font or comic sans. Kill me, end this nightmare. Why would you want either of those? Is that, is that a joke? Is that a fucking joke? You think you're funny? Do you? Fill up on a couple more super potions. I think I got plenty of all this other stuff. Maybe we buy some repels. 
That would be quite nice. Here, give me this. Fifteen of them! Ugh. Now I don't have to deal with any bullshit. No more! Hi there, how may I help you? Quick fall or X speed? Neither. You can't help me. You don't have what I'm looking for! Let's uh, explore some more of these houses. There's gotta be more mysteries, right? Hello there! What if everyone here are characters in a video game made by an internet forum? Sounds crazy and scary, right? Dude, bruh. Don't say such things. Having a chancer brings so much joy to my life. Who would have thought? Chancer? Chancy! It's like dead Chancy. It's Chancy missing eyes. That says a little disturbing. I don't know why you'd make that. Because it's like cancer. Cancer post! My eyes are gone. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh. It's a ghost house! Spooky ghost house is gone now! What the fuck happened? Dude, this place is weird. This place is weird, bruh! <laughs> this old man. That old man's so insane, he jumped from that house just like an hero. Aww, it's a dead man. He seems to hold something. Take it? Yes. Escape rope. Oh, so he didn't jump. He was just trying to escape. Rip in peace! <laughs> oh boy. He and he rode hard. But not on purpose! Hey kid, do you want to buy a Master Ball? My homie Tyrone got five of those for me. Five thousand for all of them. What do you say, white boy? Yeah. Boy, you try to scam me? Go get some more cash. Oh, I wouldn't have bought all the Max Repels if I knew they were selling fucking five Master Balls. Fart! Shit! It's alright, we'll save up. I wonder if they're real. Ah, oh, thou seek my services to help the townsfolk. Very well, child. Betoken me of the source of the disturbance. The townsfolk say it comes forth from the burial tower. Well, I did ponder the source of that peculiar music anyway. Hmm. I will meet thou thither when thee are ready. Or when ye are ready. <laughs> yeah, um... Am I ready? Is anybody really ever ready? Trainer tips! Yep, yep, okay, got it. I remember all the trainer tips, don't worry. Where's the burial tower? Up this way, I suppose. 1x attack. Wonderful! And I guess we'll put... well, Keck. Yeah, Keck is fine in the front. He's got the cleanse tag. That's how we're avoiding a bunch of shit. Oh, except this trainer! In this world, there are two kinds of people, my friend. Those with loaded Pokémon, and those who lose. What? Your Pokémon are loaded? You got a mar marijuana? Mariguana? <laughs> That's what it's called. Mariguana! Oh, loaded Pokémon because he's like a seal type or whatever. Well, that's that's interesting, isn't it? Let's go to uh, I guess Decker. Decker's the only one that could save us from this doom. I've also got uh, Douglas, and he could, you know, do his little magnitude shits too. But oh my god! Decker endured Dragon Breath. Wow. And it was a crit. That was that was fucking insane. Do we have a, a super potion somewhere? Maybe. Rare candy, fresh water, smoke ball, super potion. No, I want like a max potion. That's not gonna heal him up all the way. I don't think I have any max potions. Well, I do what it do. It heals him up halfway. Jesus. Mirror shot, that's gonna KO for sure. Ah, uh, super effective. Ah! This thing is crazy strong. I was so proud of my level 30 plus Pokemon, and this guy's level 33. What the fuck? How could this happen? Oh, magnitude 7. Get at least one Earth attack on it. Super effective! And now he's iron defensing. Oh god! Please, no! One Pokemon taking on my whole team again? Shame. Disgrace! And yeah, with that iron defense up, he's he's gonna he's gonna rape me. Look at this! He's plugging my butt. Keep going. Magnitude ten. Nope, nope, not yet. Oh god. More dragon breath. I'm dead. I'm dead. Shit. Well, what do I have? What is a decent substitute? 
Yeah, Phil. Philly! You can do it, boy! Get out there and fucking hit him with a fighting type attack. Drain punch! Phil saved my ass every time. That boy. Tell you what. And it didn't quite KO him. I'm surprised. Oh, Dragon Breath is gonna be super effective. No! Shit. Blue balls! Crap! Well, Pecker, uh, go quick attack it. <laughs> Sleep got like one HP left. Uh, quick attack. That'll do. Ba bam! Thank god. He could have just used a super potion, and that would have been the entire game. And that's the game! I lose. Yes, you do. Quite. Every Pokemon makes its own tune. Kinda? You mean like. Arr, 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 arr. Spooky, scary skeletons! Anyways, friends, we're gonna head to that burial tower in the next episode. I hope that you'll join me for it! It's gonna be super! We're gonna see some spooky ghosts and spooky, scary skeletons sending shivers down my spine. Anyways, I hope that you'll like, comment, and or subscribe. If you did enjoy this episode, that is always, always appreciated. Please also don't forget that we have links in the description to Twitter, to Discord, to Patreon, all kinds of good stuff. So if you'd like to support me in any of those ways, I would be eternally grateful to you, my good sir or madam. Probably sir, though, according to my analytics. Anyways, <laughs> uh, once again, this has been Pokemon Clover. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I will see you in the next one. I hope that you'll join me for it, friends. So until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.